pause. Have you learned how to effectively use pauses when you speak in public? Or do you find yourself like most people, tempted to keep repeating some of the words that you just said, or perhaps even struggle to get rid of these annoying fellow words that just bomb as you speak? Here's some of the benefits that come with learning how to effectively use pauses and some of the reasons I'd encourage you to embrace this the next time that you have an opportunity to speak in public. The first reason is very simple. It helps you build anticipation. There's nothing like a well-placed, well-timed pause within what you're sharing that helps draw your audience to you really want to hear what you have to say. The second reason is that it helps you convey really strong emotions. If you were to say, this is something we care about, but instead, if you were to talk to a group of employees or perhaps even colleagues and just say to them, this is really something we care about, it makes a world of difference. Number three, it really helps the audience digest what you have just said. Perhaps here's an example. If you were to speak to an audience of people who perhaps were looking to see how many people are actually actively using social media within the country, you'd say to them 99% of people between the ages of 18 and 45 are actively using social media. That's a staggering fact. So in order to convey this real message and help really people really digest this message, you'd say something like 99% of people aged between 18 and 45 are actively using social media. Digest. So the next time that you're faced or perhaps even have an opportunity to speak in public, these are some of the reasons and tips I hope you use to learn how to pause when you speak.